When it comes to cloud cover today, it did a disservice to our highs as we were quite a bit cooler than what we were yesterday. But when it comes to our temperatures right now, not that much of a change, again, thanks to that cloud cover. Only seeing a change of six degrees here in Rockford, five degrees over in Freeport from what we saw just 24 short hours ago. When it comes to our temperatures though, well, not too bad. They're seeing 25 degrees here in Rockford currently. Basically the 20 is around the state line. Wind chills, 20 degrees here at Rockford, but around the rest of the state line, looking at the upper teens. And these temperatures are going to drop ever so slightly as we continue into our overnight hours, seeing a low of 22 degrees. But you'll notice, look at our winds. We have a westerly wind right now at 6 miles per hour. But by the time we get to the 5 and 8 a.m. hours, well, our winds are calm, meaning our feels like going to be exactly what our temperatures are going to be. So it was an overnight low of 22 degrees, our rule of thumb not too far off, about three degrees warmer than our dew point of 19. Again, a lot of that has to do with our cloud cover. So tonight I would say it is a great night to have two blankets as we'll have partly cloudy skies, a lot of clouds earlier on with some clearing more towards the morning hours. And speaking of that clearing, oh, beautiful, a return to sunshine. Our winds will be from the south southwest by Monday. That's going to increase our temperatures just a little bit, seeing highs in the upper 30s for our Monday. As we head into Monday evening, our winds start to shift to become from the south, allowing our overnight temperatures to be a lot warmer than what we're seeing tonight, seeing the upper 20s for our lows. But take a look, our winds start to shift to become from the west as we head into Monday night, into Tuesday morning. And by the time we get to Tuesday, a pretty strong breeze from the north northwest. That's going to give us temperatures on Tuesday back to kind of what we saw today, highs right around that up the middle 30s. So when it comes to tomorrow, hey, we have a cookie cast for you. And when it comes to our cookie cast, we're looking at plenty of sunshine. Temperatures at 10 a.m., 28 degrees at 3, 37. And by the time we get to 7 p.m., looking at temperatures of 30. And don't you worry about these cookies getting soggy whatsoever as rainfall. Yeah, there is none to be found when it comes to the next couple days. I'm tracking an abundance of sunshine. And in addition to that, I'm tracking a big warm up on the way as well. As we head towards the weekend, temperatures look to make their return into the 40s and maybe even upper 40s and maybe even flirt with the 50 degree mark. And this is our models saying that we are going to be a bit warmer. And sadly, today, when models have updated Christmas time, looks I guess, about a degree warmer than what it did yesterday. So I sadly have to lower our chances for a white Christmas down to right around 8%. But there's still a lot of time left in December. And hopefully that number can raise back up because I would love to see a white Christmas. Monday, we see a high of 38 degrees. Wednesday, we also see another high of 38 degrees with an abundance of sunshine. A high pressure system makes its way through on Thursday, bringing temperatures back up to the 40s, seeing a high of 43 on Thursday and Friday. But Saturday and Sunday, high of 46 and 47 degrees, looking a lot nicer. It's like here we go again. We think it's the last we'll see it. Yeah. And then all of a sudden. Here it is again. Yeah, just in time for pre-Christmas. Yeah. All right. Thanks, DJ.